Well, all right, I guess this is my new Copter X CX 3X1000 Flybars Gyro for my Titan. $42 will make you holla. And I believe my USB cable will work from my um, ZYX. Found her right there. Now I'm just waiting on my CNC tail boom block because that plastic one's not holding this boom good anymore. So, yeah. Oh, and I got my um, V2 back flying again. I gave her a little test of her this morning. I share a little portion of the video with you guys. Just need to track my blades a little bit and she's ready for some more 3D. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys. Oh yeah. Woo! Can't wait to get this one done. Alright, here we go with the wiring of the Copter X ZYX. So, I guess this is my um, gyro gang rudder channel. White wire is my collective pitch. Red one's elevator and this one here it goes into the aileron channel. Well, all these go into my receiver. So let me plug these in. Okay, so let me do my tail first. Brown is ground, so I'm gonna go this way. That's my tail servo and now the gyro gang, the yellow one. Yeah, I make this video showing you how to and you actually get to see how difficult or undifficult this is. side not to the ground side the ground wires if they're not black they're brown okay and then on here channel four which is my tail So I'm going to plug the 
pitch servo. Channel three. Collect the pitch on channel three of the live bars unit. And I'm just guessing that for now. So yeah. channels one and two here Channel one and two from the receiver. Plug in the channel one and two of the fly bar this unit. I guess this shouldn't take you 15 minutes unless you're old like me. So uh, next we're going to plug these three wires back into the receiver because since we plugged our um, unplugged the servo wires from the receiver and plugged them in here, now we're going to plug this for the servo. They're, they're signal wires. They're not going to be uh, plugged in on the same side. You would plug the black or the brown. Plug in just like your gyro game on the signal side. Say so easy, even a black guy could do it. That's a joke. I guess a black guy can't do it. He can't plug in the plugs here. Dang it. And now I'm all wired in, and my next step I'll uh, 
set up my transmitter and see which way my servos are moving and thinking about mounting the receiver to the outside like my other one and, and mounting the gyro to the frame as well right here too because I'm, I think that you might pick up a little too much vibration if you're closer up here to the um, mechanical parts up here and it might be uh, better damping down here but I like it right here so this is where I want mine maybe I can mount it sideways like that will be nice and my receiver down here Yeah, I have to check my manual and see if I can mount it this way. I like that, but it's hanging off the edge a little bit, so. Might actually, yep, yeah, end up sitting up here like that. Yeah. Alright, now I guess I'll move on to the next step, which is programming. Oh, yeah. Thank you.